New at nine, a deadly drug that makes you feel numb to the world is on the rise here in Milwaukee. That drug is heroin, and last year Milwaukee police seized a staggering amount of it, 20 times more than the year before. Our Jenna Sachs live in Milwaukee with what experts say is behind the problem. Jenna. Heroin use is actually up across the entire country, and Wisconsin is no exception. They're seeing it to our west in Dane County, to our north in the Fox Valley, and all over southeast Wisconsin here in Milwaukee. Police are seizing more of it, and more people are seeking treatment. It was only Monday the deputies say a 27-year-old man lost control of his truck on I-43, veering across three lanes of traffic. The Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office says it appears the man had injected heroin while behind the wheel. He eventually crashed into an on-ramp wall. Unfortunately, those drugs like heroin are so terribly addictive. The Meta House Treatment Facility in Milwaukee is seeing more heroin use among clients. Once you've started, it can be really challenging to stop. Last year, 27% of Meta House clients reported using heroin in the last 30 days. That's way up from 2004 when the number was just 5%. It's a dangerous, even deadly trend. It can be hard to know what you're buying. It can be hard to know the purity of what you're buying. So even if this isn't your first use, you may be mistaken about your body's tolerance for that drug. Police confirmed that more heroin from Mexico is making its way up to Milwaukee. In 2011, police seized 1.97 pounds of heroin. In 2012, that number skyrocketed to 41.2 pounds. Police say one reason is economics. Heroin is a cheaper option than cocaine. But experts at the Meta House say there's also another reason. A higher volume of prescribed opiates like Percocet, Vicodin, and Oxycontin that are common gateways to heroin. We see clients start on those prescription pills, and when they run out of access to those pills or when they run out of money to be able to afford those pills, they turn to heroin. And this isn't just a city of Milwaukee problem. It's also a problem in the Milwaukee suburbs. The Milwaukee County Medical Examiner's Office tells us that at least 38 people died last year from heroin. And the number is probably higher than that. They're still waiting for some numbers to come back from the toxicology lab. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Jenna Sachs, Fox 6 News. Jenna, you know, with these numbers and the people dying from overdoses, it does seem to sort of go in spurts. Do you have any idea why? What's going on with that? Uh, it depends on the batch of heroin. Uh, sometimes they mix certain things in with the batch, and it depends on the cycle that they're seeing. Over the summer, I'm told, they actually had a period of time where they were seeing three to six deaths a day from a particularly deadly batch of heroin. Wow. That is a tragic and a tragedy for a lot of families. Jenna, thank you.